It is the first real chance for the Sprinter. It is the third stage of the 2023 Giro Next Gen. We left this morning from Plioca with Alex Segert in a Maglia Rosa leading the general classification after the first two stages. The end, the finish of the stage after 146 kilometers in Magenta. The weather not the best today, but the riders give a go and the early breakaway with five riders gain a maximum of over five minutes advantage over the group. In the breakaway we had Lindsay, Gazzola, Regnanti, Pelani and Cetoba. Back in the peloton was the cycling team Friuli very active in chasing the breakaway. They spent a lot of energy but they knew that they had a rider that could do a good sprint so when we reached 10 kilometers to go the uh, gap between the front and the peloton was under a minute at that point we knew there was going to be a sprint the last rider to give up from the early breakaway Lense devil team dsm had nothing and he tried everything but there was nothing he could do to stop this sprint and while we approached the last few kilometers few hundred meters towards the city of Magenta with the group over uh, 50, 60 kilometers an hour. It was gonna be a great sprint and it was because Trinity Racing launched perfectly. Luke Lamperty, then he, nothing had to do that sprint for the last few hundred meters to get this victory. And in second position, Alberto Blutomesso, also a great job from cycling team Friuli. What a race, what a win from Luke Lamperty the American rider of Trinity Racing was able to complete a perfect strategy from the team with two riders that launched him in a perfect position to catch this win. And here is the top 10 uh, with Luke Lamberti is the winner, Trinity Racing Team second position for Alberto Blutomesso Cycling Team Friuli third place for Team Tersenberg Leopard Team and here is the winner celebrating. Luke, first of all, congrats. Eight victories for the moment in this season. How do you feel right now? Yeah, I feel amazing. Um, I couldn't feel better. You know, we rode, we wanted to come here and get a stage win, and today was the first real target. And yeah, to get a stage win so early in the week, especially, uh, yeah, the guys rode absolutely perfect. You know, we have a guy here for GC, and he's, he's the second to last guy in the lead out riding perfect. So uh, really, really happy. Nothing has changed in the general classification with Alex Segert still leading in Maglia Rosa second position for Leuven Bell 12 seconds behind but tomorrow there is a stage with a finish on top of the Passo Stelvio at stage that could change the Giro.